Welcome to Applied Food Science and Engineering with Prof. Vigent. What's something you probably eat every day, something that's been food for a millennia, but when you hear the name, your mind will go more to the dishes than the food. What is it? Foam! Technically speaking, foam is any time you have a semi-stable suspension of air or another gas in a liquid or solid. Even more technically, gas is the dispersed phase, while a solid or a liquid is the continuous phase. This ends up describing an immense number of foods. Beer, whipped cream, espresso, meringue are probably unsurprising examples, but more surprising examples include cake, just look inside, cookies, and bread. Why are foams so yummy? Part of it is texture. Breads and other baked goods that aren't foams work if they are thin like crackers, but if you try to make anything thicker, it's pretty difficult to get your teeth into. But foaming food also has an impact on taste. Food will taste better, or at least more like itself, because a big part of the experience of tasting is smelling. Foam foods can be thought of as pre-mixed with air, so the scents are ready to travel. And that is why there's no place like foam. Thanks for watching.